Milk Drunk by Kathleen O'Malley. I have been granted leave, my first solo outing. I emerge squinting and blinking against the light. I've forgotten how to be in a public space, how to dress myself, what to do with my arms. I'm wearing too much eye makeup, nose full of my own scent, and an overly enthusiastic application of perfume. As luck would have it, I run into someone from work. Oh my god, how are you doing? What's going on with you? <laughs> I mean, aside from, you know, ensuring the continuation of the species. <laughs> yeah, aside from shepherding a beautiful being of light into the world, what's going on? In order to prepare the household for my excursion, I had hooked myself up by the tits to a six by six box and pumped, milked into bottles, mechanically, to the tune of whackle, whackle, whackle. And yeah, I'm pretty sure I've asked this exact question of a new mom in a past life. But now the question strikes me as absurd. And I know that she is honoring me, that she respects me and my abilities, and probably expects me to be doing a whole lot more at home all day than side-lying on the bed being milked. My community is driven by meaningful work, and I am driven too, a professional maybe even a workaholic. And the assumption is, well, that there must be more to say. And I have done a hundred thousand things today already, but none of them add up to anything even remotely recognizable as my previous life. A day measured by ounces, literally by drops. And I let the question sit there in the space. My edges rubbed raw, my insides still stitches, burning with the story untold, the days that are long, the weeks flying by on a sea of liquids and solids and smells and small claws moved from body to bin and my body, doctored by creams and coconut oil and ice packs in my underwear and nipples under plastic shells. I am sturdier now, Still swollen, quieter, strong. I make milk. I feed my baby. We are mama baby jungle cats. She eats and digests. She has gained length and weight. She holds her head up. She is thriving. And I am still holding that silence, now awkward. How much does she really want to know? And how much am I willing to say? Just enjoying my baby. That's it. Enjoying my baby.